Hey guys and welcome back. So today I'm filming another haul video. It's gonna be a summer, pretty much summer dresses. I think there's like one skirt in there, but summer dress, um, ASOS haul. I am literally about to head off um, to the airport in two hours time. If you could see a bit further than it's on shot, I've actually like pushed it to one side. It's my very, very messy suitcase, which is half packed. Um, and before I finish off packing, cause I want to take hopefully whichever ones of these that I keep, I thought I would do a quick ASOS haul try on and show you um, what I got. Hopefully it's not as bad as my last ASOS haul video, which turned into a haul fail because I didn't keep anything and everything was horrendous. So um, I've got quite a few little summary dresses. Just gonna jump right in. The first one, I actually ordered these last week as well and then I've been away for a couple of days so I've kind of forgotten what I ordered. Um, but the first one is this little cream and lace polka dot number. If anyone watched my last haul video, this is like, okay, this might be bad. Why do I keep going for the polka dot netting? Okay, this looks really good on the internet. Um, I think it's significantly better than the last one, if you remember, but it's like a high neck with lace. It's quite like vintage looking. It's got lace around the waist. It's got the little polka dots. It's got long sleeves, and then it's like a midi length, but it's got a tear to it. So I'm hoping that will be good. Let's have a look and try it on and see what we think, but it looks quite pretty. Might be a little bit long on me is the one thing I'm concerned about. However, it's a raw edge, so I could just cut it if I was feeling bold. I don't know how bold I'm feeling today, um, but I'm gonna try that on. Okay, I actually really like this one. I've actually put on my shoes that I would wear with it because I think it's actually a really nice length with them because you can still see the shoes. Um, it's definitely what I wanted the last one to look like in terms of polka dot, but I actually like it. I think I'm gonna take this with me for an event, like an evening dinner that we're going to, I think it would be perfect for. But yeah, I really like it and I love the detail on here and the waist. I think it's really pretty. I'll probably wear it with a Spanx, but I really like it. I think it's really pretty. Yay. Next up, I've got, um, oh, this is actually a really nice one. This is from All Saints, because they stock All Saints on ASOS. And this is a really pretty silky wrap dress. I'm actually not sure if it is, it is proper silk. It probably should be proper silk because I know that it's quite expensive because all saints. Are you silk? Tell me. Yes, it is silk. Um, it's a wrap dress and it's black and white. It's got this um, kind of floral design on it, but it's not too girly as like all saints stuff is never really that girly. It's all quite edgy, but um, it's quite like, I don't know. I quite like it because it's quite girly cut being a wrap dress, but then it's also quite, I don't know. It's got a little bit of, non girliness to it because it's black and it's not like super floral. Um, the one thing that concerns me looking at it is that it might be a little bit short. We shall see. Also a little bit see-through and it should have come with a slip, I think, personally, for that price. I think it was about £110 or something like that. 168 was actually really expensive. Um, I ordered, oh, that's why, because I ordered these with a 20% discount um, when they had like, I have ASOS Premier, which is like the um, unlimited next day delivery and they gave me 20% off that weekend. So I think it was about 120 um, with the discount. So yeah, I think it should come with a slip for that, but let's see. Okay, I do also really like this one, but it feels super, super short. I don't know if it's just because I've had a midi dress on, but it definitely feels shorter than I would normally go for but I really, really love the shape. I think it's super like lightweight and comfortable and flattering. Like I said before, it's quite feminine, but at the same time, it's not like super, super girly because it's black and with the flowers and stuff. But is it a bit short? I don't know. I feel like it's one of those things with wrap dresses as well, is that you feel like they're gonna come, like split apart a bit and like be really short at the front and flashy knickers basically. What do you guys think? Do you like this one? Keeping on the black and white theme because that's how I like to roll, apparently. Um, this skirt, which I'm pretty sure is gonna be sent back because I did not realize it's jersey and this kind of skirt in jersey is just not a good look. Um, it needs to be like a silky material. This is like a polka dot wrap skirt. I mean, it might be good. It's got like a little tie at the front, but it's like made out of t-shirt material. So I'm not hopeful, not hopeful for that. Kind of disappointed. Okay, so this one is a definite no, um, mainly because of the material. Like I said, with jersey, I just think, I don't know, actually, I like, I really like the way it fits, I like the way it looks, I just, I just really, really don't like jersey skirts. 
Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like. I think it's a cute design. I just wish they'd made it out of like a silky material because I just feel like this doesn't flow very well. It doesn't like the texture of it looks a bit funny as well. Next up is a little dress from a brand called On Creme. And I really liked this because it's a nice bright colour and I thought this would be good for kind of beachy vibes. Oh, it's actually a play suit. I forgot this was a play suit. Um, and it's like this bright orange with a blue design. It actually looks like it might be very see-through, but I actually really like it. It's very, very lightweight. It'd be really good for the beach. Um, it's got like the tie on the front. I haven't worn a play suit in a long time, so I'm not sure how. Like, they're not very practical in terms of getting them on and off, I have to say that. I would have preferred if it was a dress, but I did think it was just really, really pretty, and I just loved the design of it. And just very lightweight. I thought it would be quite good. Let's let's have a look and see what that's like. Okay, this one is a definite no because it's definitely too short. And it's also probably maybe in a size bigger, it might actually be better, but it's definitely like too short in the body as well. It would be really uncomfortable to wear, it'd be constantly riding up. You would be constantly pulling it down here. And it also is really, really hard to get on and off because it has hooks all the way up the front that you have to then hook on and then undo these ties and then take the whole thing off. So like, I like it and I like I love the sleeves and the print and the material, but it would just be so much easier if it was a dress because it just, you wouldn't have that uncomfortable kind of fit to it, if you see what I mean. And I'm not like tall at all, I'm quite a short person. So I feel like if you were tall, this would be way too short in the body. So yeah, a no, but it's okay. And then lastly for the new stuff, but I also have one older one that I wanted to show you because I never actually showed it in a video, um, is this red and white little dress. And this is an ASOS own brand one, which I'm hoping, I remember this being really loose fitting on the images and I'm hoping it doesn't just look like a bin bag because there is a high possibility of it. Hang on a minute. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, hang on. Are the sleeves like, or has it got no sleeves? The sleeves are attached. It's like a bat wing situation. Like there's a seam there. This is very strange. This is very strange. We're gonna see what this looks like on, but um, it's kind of like a little kaftani type thing, but it actually doesn't have the, um, it's like totally bat wing, like a cape. And I'm definitely gonna have to put something under this. Like obviously it's meant for like over wearing over a bikini, but for showing on YouTube, I will put like a little slip on. But yeah, we shall see with that one. Okay, so this is definitely just like a beach cover up and I've layered it with um, just my white slip so that you guys can't see anything. <laughs> you shouldn't be able to see. I actually quite like this. It's quite comfortable. I quite like wearing it like layered. It's very free people kind of vibes. But I don't know if it is just massively unflattering because it's just like a big tent. I feel like I could fly somewhere like Big Bird in here, but um, I don't know, what do you guys think? I, part of me kind of likes it, and then the other part of me is like, it's ridiculous. It also has these tassels, which I didn't realise have mirrors on them. Is this not a serious, like, risk for holiday wear, um, that you might set something alight if you're wearing it in the sunshine? I'm guessing you could, like, tie them together like that. What do you guys think? Do you like this or not? I feel like I kind of like it. It's very comfortable. And then lastly, I want to know what you guys think of this dress, honestly, because I am in two minds with it. Part of me thinks that this is like the coolest dress ever, and the other part thinks it may be way too much. But I've got a wedding next, or the weekend after next, the slip's just fallen out of here, it's not totally see-through, there is a slip. Um, part of me loves it, part of me thinks it's probably a bit OTT, but it's this, it's ASOS own brand, clearly, clearly inspired um by gucci um with the embroidery like the floral embroidery but it's like a sheer mesh dress it has the same color slip underneath it which has just hit the floor it's got long sleeves the one bit i definitely don't like and if i do keep this i'm definitely going to cut these off are these frilly bits on the end of the sleeves which for me i think is just a bit too much but it's raw edge so literally you could just cut them off in a straight line and it would be fine um and then it's embroidered all the way down it really is very very beautiful um but I don't know if it's too much. I'll put it on and show you guys, but let me know what you think. You love it or you hate it. I feel like it's one of those dresses that it's gonna be either or in terms of those, yeah. So last but not least, this is also definitely a Spanx situation on the skirt and the, uh, the lining or the slip underneath is actually really short, but something about this dress, I just absolutely love. I think it's so beautiful. The one problem I do have is the length 
it's too long and I think a lot of the embroidery goes down potentially too far to properly take it up maybe not at the back I'd have to have a, like a proper like I'd have to pin it up and see with probably with my mum because she's good at that kind of stuff but I just something about me I just I love it what do you guys think yes or no for a wedding as well is it like ott for a wedding so that is it for my little asos haul i hope you guys enjoyed it fingers crossed some of this is now going into my suitcase um and i actually have i actually i actually have something to wear on um this trip because otherwise i will just be wearing the same thing every single day um but yeah hope you enjoyed it it's a short but a sweet one i will see you very soon bye guys